What's up guys, Drift here again, and this video is sort of like a part 2 to my last video, which the views kind of blew up on, so thanks for that. You don't need to have watched the last video to understand this one, but if you haven't watched it, well, you should. So anyway, I'm going to list some more th theories I have pretty good evidence for. In my last video, my theories were Ancient Egyptian Theme or Alien Invasion Theme. In this video, I will be giving a theory for the season and also for the live event. Let's start with the live event theory first. Just a few th days ago, we got event files for a leaked high tower event. Of course, that is just a code name, but we do know some pretty interesting leaks for this. This information was released thanks to leakers like Happy Power, Fire Monkey, and Hypex. All we know about this event is that it has some sound files from the visitor's rocket and from the crack in the sky. Thanks to some more evidence, we now know that the big rift in the sky is returning. We also know that somehow we will have these ancient moon-like craters that have the battle hunt symbol on them. Anyway, moving on to the theory, I have a theory that this event will take place at Steamy Stacks. My evidence for this is that around a month ago we got updated sound for Steamy Stacks. And one of the main key pieces of evidence is that in Steamy Stacks there is a secret room with a briefcase and some suspenseful music. I don't know what this briefcase is supposed to mean, but a lot of times when Epic makes a secret room and adds suspenseful music, it means something important is happening. Plus we know the crack in the sky will come back. If you remember, the crack in the sky is what made the cube. You may also remember Steamy Stacks is a power plant for none other than the cube. Therefore, if a giant crack can make a cube, why can't the cube make a giant crack? The last point about this theory is that when I hear the words high tower, I think of a smokestack. Now, let's move on to my seasonal theory. I don't have a lot of evidence, but the one piece of evidence I do have is quite big. If you didn't know, Leaker Fire Monkey was able to access some emoticons for the next season's battle pass. Most of these emoticons have something to do with cards, which isn't exactly new. But there's one emoticon that stands out. The, this emoticon has some sort of stop sign with an image of someone hiking. If you look behind that sign, there is a jungle. This makes me believe that next season, we will be getting a jungle theme. This isn't exactly impossible. As we know, this season obviously had a lot of water, and you know what happens with water, sunlight, and plants. They grow. Another reason this might be true is if my steamy sex theory is correct and a meltdown happens, it could radiate nearby life, including all plant life. Both of these can make the island covered in jungles and vines. Perhaps we will even see the Fire King make a return. Anyway, that's going to be it for my Theory Part 2 video. Be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment letting me know any theories you might have. So, have a good day, and as always, stay in quarantine.